a planned procedure. Although the hospital in which Madiba was kept was a closely guarded secret, a convoy of official cars was seen leaving Pretoria's one military hospital. Messages poured in for Madiba's speedy recovery. In South Africa and around the world, scores of people wished him well. He's everybody's father, you know, and we want him to live forever. I'm glad he's out, you know. Mandela, he's the world president, remember that, the world president. We love him so much, he must get him better. In Soweto, this congregation sent out special prayers for the much-loved former president. Defence Minister Lindiwe Sisulu today explained why Madiba was admitted to hospital. The reason why we took him to hospital is because he did have a discomfort, an ongoing discomfort. And on a regular basis, when you attend to somebody, you want to improve the condition of that particular person. And the only way that we could finally get to the bottom of this is by taking him to hospital and having a number of tests to find out if in fact what were, was prescribed, what we're giving him was working and if we could not make it any better. President Jacob Zuma has thanked all South Africans for their love and support and says Madiba is making good progress surrounded by his family. He also thanked citizens for affording Madiba and his family the privacy and dignity they deserve. ANC Youth League President Julius Malema believes a meeting with the ANC leadership will resolve the